Welcome everyone. In today's lecture, we are going to take a look at two ideas. Firstly, I'm going to introduce you to the idea of iteration. As we shall see, it is useful to think of iteration in terms of some common patterns and we will explore these iterative patterns. Secondly, we will continue our exploration of lists where we will take a look at some powerful and very useful list operations. So let's get started. Firstly, here is a mystery function that makes use of lists. Remember something that we mentioned in our previous lecture. The items in a list need not be all of the same type. So on line 8, I'm calling this mystery function with a heterogeneous list. The zeroth item in this list is a float. The oneth item is an int and the twoth item in this list of length 3 is a string. So I can pass this heterogeneous list to this mystery function and it's eventually going to return some boolean and that boolean gets printed out. So what is this function's purpose? Well our friend has taken a good look at this function and in particular has seen this line uh, 4 which seems to be calculating the remainder by 2 and so our friend initially thinks that this function checks if any item in the given list data is even but then our friend very quickly corrects themselves and says no actually what it does is it checks if any item in this list is odd. Now why is that? Well remember that this will calculate the remainder mod 2 but if we want to check if a value is even we have to check if that remainder is equal to 0. Here we don't check if that remainder is equal to 0 we just treat that remainder as a boolean value and remember non-zero values are treated like true and zeros are treated like false. So when this quantity is non-zero meaning when the value is odd then we will actually come in here and return true. So our friend is more or less right but not quite. So let us go to Python Tutor and observe the behavior of this recursive function on this heterogeneous list. <laughs> 